Okay, we're back and I have some sample pieces set up on our frames. This is a 14 by 17. I have it sitting in the cradle. I have the arm guard on it and it's just sitting here. I don't have my feet up on any footstool. My feet are flat on the ground. It's in my lap. And here's this purple is about a size four. And sweet spot, everybody likes to hook is here. But I'm gonna show you, I'm coming right up here to the top because I've had people ask about how it stays in position when you're working. And I don't like fours, so my fives, I don't like much below an eight, so it's a little sloppy. And it's also high for that size cut. But you can see my frame didn't even lift off. I don't hook with a big hook, even though I do wide cut. This is a regular, what we call our standard hook. It's what I learned on and it's what I like. Now I'll do the eight cut. And you can see that head is not lifting at all. I am not pushing. Even if I don't put my hand on there to hold it in place, that's not lifting. This frame isn't lifting. But it's much more comfortable to sit with your arm on the edge of the frame. I have it slightly tipped toward me so that it's comfortable to work. Now here's a half inch. This is a hand torn strip. Again, I'll go up here at the top where it's most likely to lift up. Anybody that says you can't hook wide strips without a Hartman or another, whoops, another type of broad hook. Everything I do is with this hook, whether I'm doing tiny detail, which for me is a six or hand cut half inch strips. I work mostly in an eight and an eight and a half, but this is not pulling hard. It's not lifting the frame head, nothing. Looks absolutely beautiful. The frame never left the cradle. It sits securely, even though it's not fastened, just from the angle that it sits in your lap and from your hands being on it as you work. If you want to change directions, you just flip that puppy over. I'll pull this out and hook in the other areas that you have to go in. So it's not a hard frame to use. There's no knobs to tighten or loosen to change positions. Yes, it's not going to spin in a circle, but it's going to cover most of the areas that you're going to be working in just with simply turning the head around. And that's how our 14 by 17 fits in it.